A dispute over rules between county Republicans and the state Republicans was addressed in court today. The Bingham County Republican Central Committee is suing the state GOP's office for disqualifying its election for a new chairman. Local News 8 Seth Ratliff was in the courtroom today to hear the arguments. Seth, what did they have to say? Well, Todd and Linda, in today's preliminary injunction, hearing lawyers from both sides met via Zoom to lay out the facts of the case. The case revolves around the election of a new chairman for the Bingham County Republicans. They claim state GOP chairwoman Dorothy Moon declared the election invalid and announced her intentions to hold her own election. The Bingham County Republicans say she can't do that. They accused her of bully tactics and dealing with them in a deceptive manner. Moon and the state GOP argued that the Bingham County Republicans broke party rules in their election. The state GOP's attorney, Brian Smith, says the Bingham County Republicans turned the rules on their head by allowing Dan Cravens to call the election for his replacement. It was the existing chairman, Daniel Cravens. He called the meeting. He also noticed the meeting. And he also presided at the meeting over his own replacement instead of letting the first vice chair do it. A complaint was filed to Chairwoman Moon. She's required under the rules to follow up, do her investigation. She simply applied the party rules and the state law. An outgoing chairman who's vacated his position is not allowed to call a meeting, notice a meeting, and preside over his own replacement. We don't do it that way because that is inconsistent with state law and the party rules. Judge Darren Simpson says he will take the arguments into consideration and make a ruling before the end of next week. However, earlier in the case, the judge did say, quote, quite frankly, I think the defendants, or the Idaho GOP, are correct in their interpretation, end quote.